So I'm going to show you a really easy way that we can get a moon to orbit around a planet. We'll start by using the ellipse tool to make a circle in the center of the composition. We'll use the move anchor point tool to get the anchor point in the middle there. And we'll use the align tools to put it in the middle of the composition. We'll then duplicate that layer, bring it across. We'll make it a lighter color so we can see it move across the face of the planet. And we'll make this smaller. Then we'll make a new null object put that in between the two. We'll name this one Moon. Oh, moon Eye. And we'll name this one Planet. Then make all the layers 3D and parent the Moon to the Null. You want to make sure that the Moon anchor point is in the center there and the Null anchor point is in the middle of the planet. We'll then use the Null to rotate around the Y axis. So we'll put a keyframe there, move forward, and then use this value to put it up to 1 so that will be 1 full rotation and you'll see that it goes a bit 2D in the middle there so what we need to do is counteract this rotation with the moon so we'll bring up that rotation click alt on the stopwatch of the Y rotation and then we'll pick whip to the nulls rotation times minus 1 so that means whatever the rotation of the null is doing the moon will do the opposite so it'll always stay facing the camera and then um, we can make this a bit more interesting. If we trim the comp to that, we can watch it loop around. If we use the rotation tools of the null, we can shift the orientation so that it's at an angle. That's this value here. And we can also use the scale properties of the moon to make it even more interesting. So we'll put a keyframe at the beginning and the end of the composition and as it passes behind make it smaller and as it passes in front make it much bigger now if you highlight just these two middle ones press F9 to easy ease them you'll have a really smooth orbit and that's not using masks or anything it's just two shape layers and one null so that's it